General Hospital Spoilers Valentin kidnaps Jason's sons to draw him out. Hello everyone, my name is Tara G. Welcome to my channel. Before starting the video, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and give this video a like. General Hospital Spoilers tease that as the head of Pikeman, Valentin Cassidine, James Patrick Stewart, still needs to get rid of Sonny Corintos, Maurice Bernard, but after three failed assassination attempts, Valentin has decided to try another tactic. Valentin has managed to get Sonny's pharmacist to alter his bipolar medication. Only one out of every four of Sonny's pills are correct. The other three are a placebo. It's quite clear that Sonny is already starting to spin out of control. General Hospital Spoilers Valentin Cassidine hopes Sonny Corinthos destroys himself. Valentin hopes that Sonny will act so recklessly that he openly incriminates himself and goes to prison for the rest of his life. It's clear that Valentin isn't the better man he has been claiming to be over the last few years. He's well aware that those close to Sonny could be hurt if Sonny's behavior becomes too erratic. It's likely why he's tried to steer Nina Corintos, Cynthia Watros, out of Sonny's orbit but he will likely take a much more direct approach when it comes to Jason Morgan, Steve Burden. GH Spoilers Agent Cates wants Jason Morgan as bait. Jason was recently revealed to be an informant with the FBI. That means Pikeman, and by extension Valentin, is aware that Jason had been infiltrating Pikeman for the last couple years. Valentin won't be able to let Jason live because he most likely knows too much. To that end, Agent John Cates, Adam Harrington, wants Jason to act as bait so that they can finally take Pikeman down. But even though he's got an assignment, Jason doesn't have a death wish and Valentin is well aware of that fact. General Hospital Spoilers Valentin Cassidine kidnaps Jason Morgan's sons. Valentin knows that the best way to kill Jason is to lure him to a remote location. But Jason is too smart not to realize he's walking into a trap. So he won't give Jason a choice. By kidnapping Danny Morgan, Asher Antonizem, and Jake Weber, Hudson West, Valentin can ensure Jason will show up. Valentin won't want to hurt to boys, but he won't hesitate if he has to. It should all come down to the ultimate showdown between Jason and Valentin. GD spoilers. What do you think? Will Valentin's plan for Sunny work? How will Valentin take Jason out? Are Danny and Jake in danger? Anything can happen in Port Charles, so stay tuned to General Hospital airing weekdays on ABC. And don't forget to check back right here regularly for all your General Hospital news, information, and spoilers. General Hospital Spoilers Jason's undercover lover returns, Alan Jacob, had a girlfriend during time away. General Hospital, GH. Spoilers note that many people in Port Charles have been buzzing about how much Jason Morgan, Steve Burton, has changed since he was gone. Two and a half years is a long time to be away, and it's hard to think that Stone Cold didn't have another life and partake in any romance during his absence from the canvas. He's keeping mum about everything he's been through since he's been gone, however, could he have a secret gal pal that shows up in Port Charles? General Hospital Spoilers Was Alan Jacobs single the entire time? GA Spoilers note that Jason was going by the name of Alan Jacobs while he was away from PC, which means he lived an entirely different life than the one he's known for in the little town. He even got a new tattoo, which completely caught Michael Corinto's Chad Duell off guard. Information has slowly trickled in about Jason, mainly, the reason he didn't come back to Port Charles right away after the Grease Tunnel collapse, and why he was at the top of the warehouse the night of Dandy Falconer's, Dominic Zemprogna, shooting, not to mention John Jagger Cates, Adam J. Harrington, was holding over him, and who he was protecting. Still, there's a likelihood that more information will come out as time goes by. G.H. Spoilers a mystery woman appears in Port Charles. During a recent soap opera digest, Saudi, interview, Laura Wright, Carly Spencer, hinted that Jason could have had a romance while off-screen. 
Ms. Wright said that Carly would have a hard time knowing if Jason fell in love with another woman during a time in his life when she wasn't around him. She'd have a difficult time processing it all. Fans know that Ms. Spencer would likely have a jealous meltdown if a mystery woman appeared in PC and Jason was linked to her romantically. It would definitely cause a ton of drama between Charlie, whether they dabble in a relationship or not. Do you think Jason was involved with a woman during his time away? Could it have been love or just a hookup? Chime in on the discussion below. Catch the popular ABC soap each day to stay on top of the drama and visit CTS often for the best general hospital spoilers, news, and updates. General Hospital Spoilers Is Valentin really working for Pikeman? Or is he playing Brennan? General Hospital Spoilers and Rumors He's Valentin Cassidy, James Patrick Stewart, really isn't working for Pikeman or trying to take Sonny Corinto's, Morris Bernard, down. Instead, like Jason Morgan, Steve Burton, was forced to do by the FBI's John Jagger Cates, Adam Harrington. He's infiltrated Pikeman for the WSB and is playing Jack Brennan, Charles Major. General Hospital Spoilers Valentin Cassidine has old Pikeman contacts. Without a doubt, Valentin does have old Pikeman contacts from his mercenary days when he did help run Pikeman Security Group. But when Sonny was first put in contact with them, Valentin warned him to watch his back with them. Why would he do that if he was out to kill him? Valentin graduated from WSB spy school as a counterintelligence analyst and one of their best and brightest under the name Ivan Theodore. Brennan is one of the corrupt WSB agents who worked under Valentin's late father, Victor Cassidim, Charles Shaughnessy, when he headed up the WSB. Valentin has made it his mission to clean up all his father's mess, including his WSB mess. So he's really working like a double agent under the current director. GA Spoilers Valentin Cassidine's story was a line of well-thought-out bull. Valentin's story to Jack was really a line of well-thought-out bull, basically telling him what he wanted to hear, but quite believable. Sonny truly may be off his meds, but not because Valentin had them replaced with place those. It's because Sonny is paranoid anyway, and drinking constantly which he can't do when on meds. Sonny's own going to alcohol for comfort instead of staying on his medications for bipolar disorder is on him Valentin, gets all this intel from Nina Reeves Corintos, Cynthia Watros, who's worried. As far as Valentin's knowledge of the name Stone and the person they're looking for being a ghost, the WSB has also been placing bugs which Valentin's been monitoring. General Hospital Spoilers The Real Boss Still Unrevealed the real boss who's been working with Brennan and Roman Hume, Mark Englehart, is yet unrevealed. But Valentin acts like he's part of it because he's undercover. So he and Jason have been doing the same thing with the same mission only Jason was blackmailed by the FBI's Jagger, while Valentin took this on voluntarily for the WSB. Anna Devane, Finola Hughes knows nothing about this as she no longer has WSB access and Brennan was behind her ouster. He was the one who fired Frisco Jones, Jack Wagner. Valentin and Anna were involved for a long time and so of course he knows about her daughter, Robin Scorpio Drake, Kimberly McCullough, and her teenage boyfriend Stone Cates, Michael Sutton. He also knows about Jagger and Jason's history with each other, and so he has all the tools to continue his infiltration and search for the one who's called Stone. Be sure to catch up on everything happening with GH right now. Come back here often for general hospital spoilers, news, and updates. Thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe to our channel and stay with us.